Hi, and welcome to the Incredible Life of Cat. I don't know if you could see it, but I have my cart of lotions and creams. Hi, Hudson. Can you go lay down? Can you go lay down, please? Hmm. And lay down over here. No, Hudson. Dirt. He always knocks something over or runs into something. <laughs> He's like a bull in a china shop, so let's sit down. Sit. Sit. Thank you. No, you can't you can't eat mom. No. That's mine too. He's trying to eat this. So today I wanted to do part four. I think it's part four of my Bath and Body Works collection. This is gonna be creams and lotions. Just to update you guys, and because people would love to see my collection. I've got my big boy in here. The Rudu Hudson. And now he's chewing on a bone, so I apologize if there's noise, slobber, weird noises in the background. Uh, my door is open, and Mr. Brutus Biscuits is laying across the doorway watching Hudson gnaw on his bone. But we're going to get into this video, and as I go, I'm again going to be dusting things off. So we're going to start with items that were on the bottom of my shower gel cart because I have room for them there, and I didn't have room for them here. So we have, let's see, I have two strawberry pound cakes. I'm gonna slide those over there. And I'm just gonna put that stuff away in between things. Watch, it be funny if I didn't press the start button, huh? I did indeed press the button. <laughs> okay, what else do we have here? I have two blueberry bundt cake. Hudson. Okay, I'm gonna kick him out because that's annoying. Normally, I don't mind him gnawing on his bone, but for the sake of this video, I did kick him out of the room. <laughs> uh, what else did we have on that cart? Mr. Brutus Biscuits is here in, the, in, here in my office. We have Meet Me in Miami, and we have he's Dog Care Forever Red. And I have a gingham gorgeous. And now Brutus is uh, walking the way to the other cart. But I'm gonna grab everything off this cart, dust it off and go over it with you. Okay, we are ready. So I slid the things that are from the other cart over and now Brute keeps rolling around trying to play with them. Um, and now he's licking himself. So I'm going to go everything that was on the top shelf over here. It's all my body creams and a couple lotions. I actually need to dust this off too while I'm at it. We have, and I'm going to be using this this year, I hope. This is champagne, apple, and honey. I don't think I've used this at all. Still smells terrific, still looks good. So hoping to finish this up. This is not a glotion. It is a regular body butter. So it does have a little sticky on it, but that's because at some point I know I uh, had this in a pile or had stuff stock stacked on top of it. And now Brutus is interested in what I'm doing. Um, Where do I want to start? Okay. I think I'm going to start with ones I know I have one of, or actually some pump lotions too. So I do have an apple from the Simplicity line, I believe. Um, I have not tried this at all yet, so hopefully I will have some type of review in the future for you. I am going to review items that are new to me, whether it's brand new or just new to me. That way you guys can kind of get my opinion on them. Um, I'm trying to unbury some stuff first. So I have two of the pump bottles of the Eucalyptus Spearmint Stress Relief. I use this every once in a while and I do have, I believe at least one more shower gel for it, shower gel body wash type of thing. And I know that I have at least one spray, one to two sprays. My daughter likes the sprays for this as well, but she hates lotions, so I'm gonna use it. 
And then I have this, and this was one where I'm like, I after I got it, I just really kind of regretted getting this. This was from the Aroma Oasis set that they had for aromatherapy. It's sandalwood, eucalyptus, and mandarin. It is a decent scent, but it's just it wasn't exciting for me, or I don't think anybody else. So <clears throat> I am when I do purchase from aromatherapy, picking and choosing things that I know that I'm gonna love. Just you know, because I'm gonna be the one trying to use it up. Um, this is open, so I haven't gifted it to anybody, but I'm going to eventually want to try and use this one up. Is that all my pump lotions? No. I have, this I got in an SAS, and I think I have stuff that goes with it, or at least a spray. This is the Eucalyptus and Tea Stress Relief. Hi, Brute. And I also have a tea tree and peppermint. This I know I have corresponding um, spray to. I don't remember on the shower gel part, but I would like to use these like in the evenings or something. See if they assist with any stress I've been having. We have musk and I have two of this one. I have two creams, I think two shower gels and two sprays. Here's the other one. You can tell one of them has been used. I am not decluttering this stuff because I, I do plan on using a lot of it. I don't like doing declutter videos just because I don't have a lot of time to do them. And because sometimes when I declutter, I just give them to my sister. So there's that. And I don't get that excited about them. I don't give away a lot of things. I do use a lot of stuff. Um, <clears throat> I have four Tutti Fruity candies. This I'm throwing in throughout the year. Last year I had one that I had a whole year and there was nothing wrong with it. So I hopefully that's the plan for this. I have one lavender. I'm not getting into lotions yet. I'm trying to focus here. I have two midsummer dreams. I always kind of shake them to make sure. This one seems to have a little bit less than that, but I do want to work on this <laughs> at some point. This is one that... I got from someone else's declutter on Mercari with a set because I was looking for something in particular. I do have a fine fragrance mist and now a, um, my God, and now a shower gel to it. So I am planning to use this up pretty soon. I actually need to put this on my shelf. Watch, that's going to fall on my head. Um, also another one that I need to put on my shelf. This is Gingham Gorgeous. I really like this fragrance for a floral fragrance, so definitely want to work on this one. Oh, so I have a lot less strawberry pound cake than I thought I did. Not that you guys care, um, <laughs> but I will explain that in a minute. I have a pastel skies. I have one candy apple cauldron. So I have been trying my best to avoid buying creams unless that's all I can find for that scent. This one, I did not see a lotion at the time of purchase and I have not looked to see if there's one now, but this is one of the new fragrances for Halloween. I am planning on trying to work on all of my Halloween fragrances in the month of October. You know, I, if I finish them before get, Halloween gets here, that's just the way it's gonna be, but I do wanna work on this. I have a firecracker pop and I bought this to save for next year because last year I did the same thing and it worked out perfectly. I have one sweetheart cherry. This one I do want to work on because I have a love hate relationship with this. I like it sometimes and then I don't like it. And as you can see, these came, this one and strawberry pound cake came yellow already. It's not like weird or gross or anything yet. So I do want to work on these so they don't go bad. I also have a so uh, soda strawberry, a strawberry soda. This one looks perfectly fine. This was from the summer SAS. So maybe save it for next summer. Or if I just, you know, I kind of look at it like, you know, if I get a craving for it, let's just go ahead and use it. Now, this is surprising to me. I only have these three. I don't think I put any others over there. Um, strawberry pound cake body cream. I had a lot before, so I'm pretty happy with this, you know, having this amount. I thought I was going to be going through it forever. 
So I'm happy about it, but also, you know, I'm going to miss my creams when they're gone. If they have it in the next year or so and I'm purchasing it at that point, sure, I'll pick it up. But a little bit at a time to work on these. And I have three iced lemon pound cake creams as well. I've been trying to use, like, for sets like this where I have creams and lotions, I try to use my creams first so I can use them up. Our summer here is hot, but it is dry. I am not as sweaty as I used to be, like, when I was in the Bay Area when it was hot. It's a very dry heat most of the time, so I don't have an issue with using, like, creams and lotions um, between using either or. I do know that cream... While it does keep me more moisturized during the winter time, I will use either or during the winter and the summer, no matter what season. And then the last couple of items I had up there were lotions. And we have pumpkin swirl cake, two of them. Another blueberry bunk cake. I don't have an addiction problem. I don't know what anybody's talking about. Um, we have another forever red. We have a cinnamon donut swirl, and we have a velvet sugar. And I have one Waikiki Beach Coconut. I usually, usually use this scent about once a year, so I'm probably going to hold on to this until next year. But I'm going to reload and offload the next couple of scents. Just checking in, there was four of them. Okay, so second shelf down. We have a lot. <laughs> So I'm going to be trying to just set some of the stuff up here. I've got several different strawberry pound cakes here. I've got two faceted strawberry pound cakes. I have one of this one, which is from a couple of years ago, 2022. I only have one of these that I can see. And I have two of them that are from this packaging thus far. I just found two more that were on the bottom of the shelf. <laughs> so I'm trying to kind of get them in order. And I need to grab the other ones that are over there, actually. So I need to leave space for two of them. But, oh, I found a third faceted one. Look at me. Okay, there's going to be a lot of editing going on. So these two that I had earlier, I'm going to be putting in here. That way I can keep things I have a lot of together. And I also have one in this packaging. So as you can see, I do need to work on both my lotions and my creams. The next is ice lemon pound cake. Um, I'm looking because there's more. So far I have three more in the original packaging. One, two. Three, four. And five. So I have like eight of these, so I have plenty for now. Um, I do use a lot of it though. Next, let's see. I thought I had four of these. I think I only have three now, but this is coconut cream pie. Absolutely adore this scent. One of my favorites. Okay, since I'm matching stuff up, I'm grabbing off of a different level here. We've got wild Madagascar vanilla. We have two so far. Three. Four. <laughs> I'm going to go for Cotton Candy Clouds. I got one, two, three, four. Okay, so I think I'm making progress here. Um, we've got how many champagne toasts? Three champagne toast in total right here. I have one into the night. I've got one ghoul friend. All right, guys, so progress is progress. I've got four Fireside Flurries. I have three Midnight Amber Glow Lotions. Two that I know of of Tahiti Island, Tahiti Island Dream. 
I'm only seeing two strawberry snowflakes. I think that's all I have, and I have one mist left. I've got three snowflakes in cashmere. I have half a bottle left of this, but I found um, an off brand that was from Walmart. Um, I don't know the name of the brand off my, the top of my head that kind of smells like this, so I'm probably going to use it with this this year. Four frosted coconut snowball. So I have four warm vanilla sugar and figured this is a great base that I can um, mix with. But next time after I'm done with these to get something to mix with, I'm going to get kind of a plain lotion from the store and see if that works for me. Probably something unscented or maybe like a light cashmere scent, light vanilla, very light vanilla scent, something like that. Ooh, Jolly Gingerbread Village. I have sprayed this, self on my, sprayed this on myself, but I haven't used it yet. I thought I had more than one more pumpkin swirl cake and maybe I went over it already. Or I don't know where it is. <laughs> you know, it might be in the other room. <laughs> All the stuff I can't fit right now. Um, and I have two pumpkin pecan waffles. And the next one, I'm going to give you my sob story. Um, I do love marshmallow pumpkin latte, and I only have this left, but I have several sprays. I'm holding off on buying it. I know they brought it back out. Let's see if I can wait till I saved up some money and want to shop a sale. If not... Maybe if it comes back at semi-annual sale. If not, I will just have to wait until next year and see if I'm going to get it or not. It makes me sad, but it's something that I need to do. Um, I also have two champagne, apple, and honey to go along with that cream. I think I only have one spray, so I might just save the lotions for another time and mix it with something. I don't know. Two iced uh, sugar plum. I remember I tried this back in the day. I don't remember what it smells like or using it, but I do have stuff to go with it. I have two Twinkling Midnight Skies. I have two more Blueberry Bundt Cake and we already know I really like this scent, so that's why it keeps reappearing. I do have a Cucumber Melon, a Butterfly, a Bonfire Bash. I also have a Whipped Berry Meringue and a Joy Sugar Snickerdoodle. So, I was able to fit a little bit more up here on the top now that I've kind of sorted everything. But that is it for my body cream and body lotion collection. This does not include my minis or my hand creams. I will do a separate video for that for you guys. So until next time, I'll talk to you later. Bye.